Am I the asshole? For telling my boyfriend it's not a random woman's job to educate his child. When he later told me about the incident I just stared in disbelief. I asked if he didn't think the woman was stressed enough without him hanging over her like that. He said to me that he thinks where his daughter is special needs the lady should have been more obliging. That's when I said it wasn't that woman's job to educate his child and that he had crossed a line. He thinks I'm being inconsiderate and insensitive. I don't feel I am, I feel he was insensitive towards the woman and her new baby and I feel he's entitled for thinking the woman should have taken the time and allowed them to just stand there and watch her nurse when she clearly was trying to hide from people. I also think it's weird he asked if they could watch so she could learn. If a man asked me that I'd think he was a pervert using his kid as a thinly veiled excuse to watch me. Not the asshole. Your BF should have removed his daughter from the situation instead of hassling a stranger. Not the asshole. Your BF is an entitled ah. Uh, that poor woman. He probably ruined her day. Sorry but I'd have been a lot less polite. Not the asshole but God, your BF isn't his creepy. Not the asshole. The way he treated that woman is the way he'll treat you eventually. Lace up those running shoes. Oh, hell no you are not the asshole that poor woman. She most definitely thought your BF was a creep. She's a brand new mom, awkwardly trying to nurse her infant in public, and your pervert BF was not only trying to watch but making his daughter watch as well. Is daughter capable of understanding nursing? Nta. And thank you for not indulging in your BFS bizarre entitlement. I can't believe he had the gall to basically want to stand over the woman like a vulture just so his precious daughter can be calmed down. No. It isn't a new mom's responsibility to parent his kid. He should have removed her from the fast food place and took her home. I hope he has practiced soothing her moods when this happens at other times and doesn't depend on someone else to do it. I'm surprised she didn't call the police. I'd have had him arrested. Not the asshole. I'm an autistic woman. Your boyfriend is not doing right by his daughter. Your boyfriend's daughter being special needs doesn't entitle her to trample on the boundaries of others. Your boyfriend was inconsiderate and insensitive for being pushy after the breastfeeding woman refused his request and for keeping his daughter in a situation that must have felt like torture for her. Definitely not the asshole. Like you stated, it isn't a random mother's job to try and nurture and teach another person's kid. She was trying to take care of her own child and was most likely stressed. So having a strange person and their child approach her while trying to calm her own child down was probably exhausting. Not the asshole your boyfriend is doing a great job of teaching his daughter that other people's boundaries and personal space don't matter at all. Are you sure your boyfriend isn't autistic? That's just a complete misunderstanding of what would be socially unacceptable a bigger failure to pick up on her emotional cues that he was making her extremely uncomfortable. His child isn't exempt from giving a nursing mother some privacy. He really needs to figure out a better response to his daughter being set off by crying babies than this. X200B. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I have a nonverbal autistic child and when she becomes overstimulated by noises like crying I remove her from the situation and get us somewhere quiet to give her a chance to regroup. What he did was definitely a violation of that woman's privacy and I'm not even sure that his daughter was upset for the reasons that he thought she was. Either way you are correct it's not a stranger's responsibility to soothe or educate his child but his own. Chances are he was only making things worse by continuing to expose her to the loud, crying intention of that interaction. Not the asshole I agree with you, that poor woman. He just made that highly uncomfortable for her. If she was trying to nurse too I feel this would be extremely upsetting. His daughter may never get used to unexplained noises that upset her, but that's going to just have to be part of life as in instances like this. People can't or won't accommodate what he takes as a learning experience. He would be much better off teaching coping mechanisms. Not the asshole. I don't usually agree when everyone tells someone they need to break up with their boyfriend. But you need to break up with your boyfriend. What he did was unbelievably inappropriate and creepy. And his daughter is 13 and doesn't go to any therapies? Think about the long term. Do you want your life filled with a creepy guy and his daughter that's allowed to do whatever she wants? Not the asshole. He asked if they could watch the woman breastfeed. That is creepy and disrespectful. Not the asshole, your boyfriend was creepy and entitled. He should have removed his daughter from a situation that was obviously upsetting her as well, instead of taking her closer to the source of what was upsetting her. Not the asshole. Your boyfriend was being creepy, regardless of his motives. The woman is trying to take care of her crying baby and he barges up while she is nursing and demands to stand there while she feeds her baby? Also while he has a screaming child in tow? 
WTF. Not the asshole. I've read your comments and I'm really concerned for you and your daughter if you stay with this guy. Please get out now. You sound like a smart and good-hearted person and you and your daughter do not need this train wreck. Op not the asshole. But I do think I agree with other Redditors after reading your comments. It is time to leave. To get yourself out of what is will become a dangerous situation. You have a young daughter to protect and he will always prioritize his child over your. And your child will be in danger from her. Not the asshole. Your BF wanting to lurk around while a new mother breastfeeds her baby is beyond the of his intention to make it some kind of teachable moment for his daughter. It's a bit shocking that he has doubled down on thinking his behavior was show him this thread so he can see how far off base he truly was. Not the asshole. I have to ask, does your BF have primary custody of his daughter? It sounds like he does not. It sounds like he's the fun, weekend dad, if he was looking after her a lot of the time, he would have known that stepping outside with his daughter, so that his daughter could have a calmer environment, would have been the best way to deal with this situation. Good God's not the asshole. But your BF sure is. This is a red flag. Not the asshole. If she was nursing a newborn, it can be difficult to get them to latch, to be physically comfortable, etc. Having a strange man and screaming child hovering next to you would make things significantly harder. It's not her responsibility to explain things or allow people to watch. I'd also think pervert if I were the mother in that situation. Not the asshole your BF tried to have a teachable moment but it should have ended as soon as it started. Imagine asking to watch a woman nurse for any reason I shudder thinking about it. He completely invaded that woman's space and did nothing to help his daughter. For children experiencing sensory overload get them away from it, and not closer to it. It's not about the reason for the noise it's about the noise itself he clearly needs more education. Not the asshole, my brother is also on the spectrum and what my parents always did was say the mom and dad are taking care of it which helped him to better tune it out and move on. Now he says it first whenever we're out and there is an upset child. What they did not do is bring him over to the screaming children, as that would have been incredibly distressing for him, and force the other parents to explain why the child was crying. Your boyfriend handled it in the absolutely worst way for everyone involved. Not the asshole. We're just going to call it what it is your boyfriend harassed a stranger. If she was tucked away in a corner she clearly didn't want people around while she fed her baby. He should have removed his daughter from the situation once he realized the lady was trying to feed her baby. I'm equally baffled and disgusted by the gross entitlement, lack of self-awareness, and poor judgment your boyfriend has. He's a huge ah. The world doesn't revolve around his daughter just because his world does. Not the asshole. Your boyfriend is an inappropriate weirdo. Whoa not the asshole. That poor mother. What a horrible, uncomfortable situation he put her in. Added omg she was trying to nurse. What the ever loving fuck. What a violation to that mom. I'm not a mother, probably won't ever be, but I'd have lost my fucking mind at him if someone was trying to bully me into letting his screaming 13 year old watch a newborn suck my tits not to be vulgar but there you are. Christ. Not the asshole. Not only is it disgusting that he expected a random woman to educate his child, it doesn't sound like he understands his daughter's sensory issues if he thinks the thing that needed to happen for her breakdown to end was understand what was happening to the baby. His daughter didn't cry because the baby was crying out of empathy for the baby's suffering, or fear of the baby's hurt, or whatever he thinks. She cried because the baby was loud and loud shrieking sounds are inherently distressing. Parent of an autistic child, who also used to cry when a baby cried here absolutely not the asshole and you are absolutely correct. It is no one's job to teach or calm his child but his. It is extremely entitled to expect the world to bend to your will just because your child is autistic. He should have removed her from the situation and tried to explain it to her, rather than stressing out a new mother. And I agree. If anyone, man or woman asked to stick around and watch me nurse, I would be horribly alarmed and not feel safe or comfortable at all. Leave him. I don't think his daughter cared if the baby was okay or not. I think she was having a sensory overload from the sound and responding in kind. He should have instead taken her to a quiet place, instead of getting all up in some poor woman with her boobs out's business. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You nailed it. Your boyfriend needs to understand that the general population simply doesn't care about his daughter like he does. Never will. The mother of the crying baby cares about her baby and your BF created the stressful situation. He needed to exit the restaurant with his daughter and call it a day. Not the asshole. What your boyfriend did was intrusive and tbh pretty creepy. 
Oh my god I thought the daughter was going to be a toddler, not 13. Neither situation is okay obviously. I can't imagine what was going through that poor woman's mind when a man and his crying teenager came over and asked to watch her breastfeed, I would ask the restaurant to remove him on the spot. Not the asshole, it's weird he'd think that's appropriate. Not the asshole and ma'am I apologize sincerely but reading your responses to questions. You need to run please get out now. He is not good for you at all. He doesn't even sound nice to you. I'm sorry for this but it's best you save yourself. Not the asshole he brought his daughter right up to the woman and baby and said see the baby is fine but his sister's crying got louder. He asked the already visibly stressed woman to explain to his daughter why the baby is crying and noted she was autistic. Oh my god I think you should consider his response here very telling that he felt justified in invading someone else's space, taking their attention from their crying, hungry infant. Other people aren't his daughter's learning experiences. He is responsible for teaching his child. Not the asshole. Your boyfriend should have been parenting his own child rather than preventing a woman from caring for her newborn. Not the asshole. It's actually him being ableist he cannot assume every stranger is safe and has capacity to deal with his kid. That's aside from it being wrong to harass sleep deprived new mothers who are just trying to feed their babies. Sounds like you should get out while you can. There are a ton of expectations that come with his attitude. Not the asshole and you're 100 right. Also he was actively making the situation worse for the baby. Boobs aren't like bottles where milk just flows endlessly. You have to relax enough for the mammary glands to release the milk, it's called let down. I can't imagine she was able to get calm enough for that to happen with him in her face pressuring her. Meanwhile her baby is hungry and would wail until either they pass out or food goes in their mouth. Good lord he was selfish and oblivious. Not the asshole. The woman was just feeding her child. She obviously didn't appreciate being treated like an animal at a zoo. You're right, it's not random stranger's job to teach your boyfriend's daughter about the facts of life.